How long do you intend on keeping me waiting? The photographer is surely wondering what's become of us. Come, we mustn't dawdle. I already told you I ain't going. Why in the world would I have my picture taken with you just for some measly school paper? Why? Because you and I are house wardens, and the next feature is intended to acquaint new students to our dorms. Thus, I am obliged to place all alluring assets of Pomfior on display for their viewing pleasure. House wardens are the face of the dorm, as it were. There's nothing you can say that'd talk me into getting pretty up over a school paper. Why not write just some spiel about us instead? A professional never cuts corners, and never would there be a truer tragedy than a spiel without an accompanying visual. You're coming. That is final. <sighs> May as well be arguing with the wall. Let's get this over with. Wait, have you failed to notice that the button on your vest is loose? Who cares? It still does what it's supposed to. Uh-uh, this won't do at all. The way it dangles makes you look no better than a common pauper. A what? This is why I detest Savannah Claw. Each and every one of you is more boorish and uncouth than the next. How I pity your poor uniforms. I will safely assume you don't carry a sewing kit with you, as a proper gentleman of your age would. Do I rightly assume that, as a prince, you've been taught that an inability to attend to yourself is somehow acceptable? Ugh, it's unbelievable that you and I both rank as house wardens. As I've no other choice, I shall deign to grant you use of my sewing kit. Now fix that button at once. Um, why ever are you taking off your vest? Sorry, I'm being rude. But it will do me well for a dignifying gentleman like you to show me how it's done. Why do I have to fix your button? Well, you don't have to. I'm perfectly fine going like this. But this is how you want me to look on such an important occasion. I... There he is. They'll show him it. Known through all of Twisted Wonderland as fairest of them all. Still, he must be awfully full of himself to not even spare a passing glance at who's standing next to him. I imagine that's what people would think, seeing me next to you. What heck if I care? <laughs> Go on. Show me how it's done since I'm so, what was it again, boorish and uncouth. Your smirk right now is utterly appalling. Give me your vest and be quick about it. Huh, singing a new tune now, ain't ya? You're little more than a fine prop to decorate my stage. And a professional always looks after his props. I'm one heck of a pricey prop, though. Better show me some gratitude. Have you no shred of dignity? If it weren't for this photo shoot, this vest would... Hmm? What is it? This button is similar to the others, but clearly different. This isn't one of the originals. You do know how to sew. Terribly slipshod work, of course. You could have tried to use a matching button. Who cares when you can barely notice it? Ugh, to think you tricked me into fixing it for you. It wouldn't have mattered if you did or didn't, you know? 
buttons always come back. Excuse me? Buttons come back? Every time one of them comes off, I just hang my stuff in my room, and the button's suddenly back on again. So there's never any point in putting the time to fix it. It's funny, though. Can't say I recall ever casting a spell like that. That would be because you clearly never did. Someone is fixing them for you. Ruggy, I'm sure. So? Magic, Ruggy, it fixes itself either way. Ugh, you are repugnant! The only thing you have going for you is a handsome face. What was that? This is why I hate spoiled princelings.